hello friends uh, this is another video tutorial just before the CSI net exam and uh, I've been receiving th this question for a long time which books to follow for CSI net exam and actually I prepared one video uh, of this which books to follow just uh, like two years back but uh, that was old so I'm just going to upload another new video and this is the video for you uh, like the the first thing that I should tell you about uh, finding book and the right book for you is there are two components for the preparation of CSI net with the help of books first part is uh, books to understand a topic and subject uh, that is very important because it's required for the preparation of part C and for also memorizing which is part B but second part comes as a practice so there should be a practice set so set of questions that you will really practice now the problem with most of you people is that you start reading books you start reading same topic from maybe like let's say five uh, different books but you never practice the questions that is the biggest one of the biggest mistakes uh, that you do in the uh, in the preparation of CSI net or any other competitive exam you need to prepare you need to practice it's not only that preparation you took preparation for two books it's done nothing like that prepare read it from one book it's fine but then practice from five six different books if you have or five six different sources if you have uh, use Google uh, the internet sources different websites there are free websites uh, that offers different question papers and so many different tips and tricks things like us like Shomus Biology as well there are many other websites as well you can take help from them also uh, they provide you free stuff and also important stuff uh, more importantly now without uh, any further discussion there so the first part of the books that you need for the proper preparation so for understanding a subject to get a good knowledge of the subject you need to read in depth so in those cases uh, small note like books will not help you uh, let's say you don't know about development biology at all uh, reading just notes will not help you much you need to read at least the background of it very well so you need some book from, uh, to read but the problem is again the books that are listed most of the cases they are high priority books and also they are higher standard books designed for masters or students in that subject but that's not what we want because that, that will be huge complications and so many different advanced level writing up there in those books so it's it's kind of difficult for us to choose uh, different stuff from from the book that we want to follow so here I'm just going to give you in the first part I'm just going to give you the idea about uh, the different names of the book that you can go for for different units so unit wise name of the book and uh, I'll also tell you the books that are available in the market which combines everything together all this 13 modules together and based on the CSI and NET pattern only and there are also plenty of books out there in the market I'm just going to tell you my honest opinion about choosing a good book from the market based on this idea about covering whole CSI and NET syllabus so the first thing uh, if you want to choose a specific book for specific topics which are in details in depth in that case uh, the module one or unit one that is biochemistry you go with principles of biochemistry by Nelson and Cox go for uh, the module two that is cell biology you go for Bruce Alberts this is one of my favorite books because it is uh, very very well illustrated and cell signaling immunology portions some part and also cancer biology is well well enough illustrated there module 3 that is molecular biology and especially the part of like uh, the DNA replication transcription translation that part you can go with Watson et al uh, that's a good book uh, and about the first part when you want to talk about the structural biology of proteins and stuff you go for white and white biochemistry module 4 that is uh, the immunology as well as uh, the host pathogen interaction uh, you go with Kubi immunology or Janeway's immunology but both the books are huge you don't need that much of content and even if you take the book you won't be able to cover everything module 5 that is development biology uh, the development biology by JMW Slack that is one of my favorite or Gilbert but both this are very much advanced level books so you don't need everything just the introductory chapters will help module 6 that is plant physiology in this case you can go for principles of plant physiology by Walter Stiles that's one thing or yeah that is that's pretty much the book that you can follow it it's enough it's well written module 7 animal physiology uh, in this case human physiology mostly it's from an Indian author CC Chatterjee human physiology by CC Chatterjee you can look at that it's like whatever part you need it's there uh, and it will be easy for you to read module 8 genetics uh, I prefer I genetics by Russell 
and for solving math problems from genetics you can refer to Klug and Cummings concepts and connections of genetics. Module 9 diversity of uh, life forms you can easily go for uh, like this part module 9 these are the regions like not any spe special book is there for it. So mostly you need to go for uh, the second part of the books that I'm going to tell you about uh, the Indian author books combining all the CSN and syllabus only go for those books. One of the example is Arihan publication. Arihan publication published the book with blue color cover. That book contains module 9 pretty well as well as you can go for uh, the, the Pathfinder book as well. But in this case comparatively Arihan provides some more information there. Module 10 ecology and environment biology. In this case, you can go for Essentials of Ecology and Environmental Biology by S. V. S. Rana. Uh, that is one good written book. Module 11, that is Evolutionary Biology and Animal Behavior. In this case, you can go for Understanding Evolutionary Biology by Rajit Tyagi. And uh, like this book is well written and also it contains many different topics that all of which you don't need to prepare for CS and NET exam. But only take those that you need it. Most of you have library. It's not uh, justified to book, uh, buy 12, 13 books for now. You can download them online in free sites, free ebook sites. If you don't get those books uh, in ebook format, you can go for your library. You will find these books easily in your college or university libraries. You can take it from there, uh, take a printout or Xerox of some pages that is required and you can go up with it. Now, how to know which topics are required for a book? Now watch my other video on that. I already made a video on which topics you need to figure out, which topics you need to follow from each and every single module and each and every single chapter. Watch that video, you'll get to know which topics you need to Xerox from those books and that will help you. And the last one, module 13 and in this case, Wilson and Walker, Principle and Techniques of Biochemistry and Molecular Biology, one of the best written books in biological techniques ever. And these are the 13 different books that you can follow separately branded books which are good written well written books for every single module now if we put all these books together and the materials together it will like stack this whole uh, table of mine and uh, I mean uh, to be honest that to get six months of preparation or even one year it's not quite enough to read through all the book and even if you can it's very difficult for to for you to remember what you've read so it's it's not logical to go for complete books for every single topics and that is the reason we have combined books, compiled books with all the chapters written in the form of CSI net preparation guide only. And for those books, we have different books in the market. We have R. Gupta, we have Arehant, we have Upkar publication, we have Pathfinder and we have Ace the Race for Biosmart, I guess. So five different book names I, I took here. Now the, the, the thing is you know there are this this books available in the market for combining CSI and NET syllabus and also uh, combining uh, the question answer because the second part is also important that is to prepare uh, the questions from. So I'll talk about that later but right now if you want to talk about the combined books there are plenty of the combined books in the market but I found this five uh, book that I told you they are at least countable uh, in the main scale and in those five books. I can tell you comparatively, like one thing I can tell you about all the books that I told you, most of the books they gather information from internet and they kind of present those informations uh, using internet. So even though they are plagiarized but that doesn't matter because they well enough compile all the information. So you'll get all the information in a single book. So like if you are manually want to do it, you don't even need any book to follow because they actually get the information from internet from different sites. So you can yourself go there and, and scrap the information. But the thing is, you know, most of you people right now is not devoting yourself to finally work hard. You know, you need to work hard to, to achieve goal like CS and net fellowship. Like people want everything to be spoon fed in right now. Like they are standing there like you, you decide like if you join a coaching, they will give you everything. They'll, they'll spoon feed you everything and ultimately you'll get the chair. That's not the case. You need to work hard. You need to get your notes the best thing possible is to make your own notes that most of you people don't want to do. You want uh, instant notes in your hand so that you can start reading. And the, from the first day if you start reading notes, the idea about notes and handouts is completely different from the idea of a book. The idea of a book is written in a way so that you can read and gain in-depth knowledge while a note is only helpful when you know the overall idea about the subject and you're uh, preparing only just before the exam, reading through it, going through it, brushes through it. 
that's the idea about the handouts and notes but these days people only focus on notes so ultimately what happens the knowledge becomes shallow there's not no depth in it so then when you try to and, and there is no practice of any questions as well before the exam so the only thing you do during the exam you start pra practicing that's the first day you're attempting the question you haven't done that earlier you probably read that topic several times from different books but never ever sit for an exam so you don't have any experience in answering the question though you know the know different topics but it's almost different to answer the question than knowing a topic and as you have a shallow depth of knowledge in that case uh, it's it's most of the cases failure that even you think of a question it's very close that you know a little amount it but there are something missing from your knowledge that could have get to the answer of the question that is another big problem that's occurring so without any further ado i can tell you the name of those books now uh, apart like three books i can choose from all those five books i told you uh, one is arihan publication book for note uh, and the pathfinder book and there is the race these are the three books i am talking about uh, comparatively if you look at here all of these three books cover every chapter of csi net from 1 to 13 now comparatively a pathfinder is well constructed uh, written book based on the topic that you need to know and they are highlighted they are bold and letters those arrangements are good but in form of illustrations arihan book is far better in, in terms of illustrations they provide a lot of pictures lot of tables and graphs and stuff which will help you to remember very quickly so it's a better idea that you have this two book in combination you take pathfinder as well as you take arihan book together and what you need to do is go for arihan book go for the tables there are a lot of tables in the arihan book that those are really really high yielding tables which which will be really important for you to remember and memorize things very fast well take the pathfinder book as a solid uh, background to build a solid background and take pathfinder uh, take the arihan book uh, to go for all those memorizing tables and illustration to understand the topic combining those two things together you'll get a good combination and comparatively those uh, two books are not good in every chapter like pathfinder book almost uh, talks about biochemistry almost half of the first volume is filled with all these things uh, while uh, if you look at Arihan book, Arihan book uh, is well written for the module number 10, for the module number 11. Those are the chapters are very well written in Arihan book, 9, 10, 11. Uh, while molecular biology, cell biology and biochemistry is very well written in uh, the Pathfinder book. And third one is Ace the Race. Ace the Race is also, it carries so many, the maximum write-up is there in the Ace the Race, covering every single topics and in details and stuff. But the problem with Ace the Race, it's a huge book. There are three volumes and uh, uh, the, like huge contents out there with question and answer and everything is out, out there. So it's huge. Like, like if you can say the depth of the book, like this much uh, amount of book. And you don't need that much of information, but still uh, Ace the Race is also a comparatively good book compared to the rest of the other one. So that's what you can go with uh, what's there in the market. Apart from that, I'll recommend you. If you want to really know biology, if you want to really understand biological science, there is no good book than comparatively to uh, the Campbell biology, Campbell and Reese biology. That is the best book available, like ever written in life science, in biological science, ever. So if you want to have a solid background, solid understanding of topics and subject to improve your knowledge for part C, and if you have good time in your hand, like one year, one and a half year for your preparation, get with Campbell and Reese. And that book is not only dumping information on you, because most of the books that I told you, they're dumping information, they're written informations. But Campbell and Reese is not giving you only information. It's giving you information in a properly sequenced manner. That is known as a conceptual approach. That's why it's called as a concept and connections. So they are providing a concept and con concept based learning about for each and every chapter there are several different concepts that they will give you information about then they'll ask you question from there so it's it's a proper scientific way of building knowledge about a subject and that's that's very good so this one book will like is, is far important than compared to the every book combined together that i mentioned but if you have less time to prepare and you need everything in in one place go for the books that i told you in the market and if you want to even study your other parts like molecular biology, cell biology from different books, I already told you about that also. So these are the books uh, that you can usually go with and, and uh, read. Uh, and the second part of the books that I can go is the question and answer preparation. Because you know it's not 
uh, only important to go and read but it's it's even more important to answer the questions so for answering questions you need to go with books like like there are plenty of books for question answers even in the market but I personally recommend only the last year question paper so last 10 question papers are enough for you to prepare if you prepare last 10 question paper that's five years question paper that is the best practice that will be there to prepare for because you know the model questions that they make in most of the books is the race contains model question book two some different volumes for that it's a huge question I already got that I, I checked that out like the questions they construct they just have to construct questions that's why they make questions out of it like it's like from every single line they want to make a question it's not up to the mark this is not the type of question that you're going to get in the exams and not going to get in the CS handed well not all the questions there are a few good questions as well but you need to again screen from the questions and also the biggest problem with all these books available in the market is the wrong answers even though they give and construct a question but the answers are really really messy really really bad and most of it the explanations are also illogical so even if you go with all those questions uh, it can puzzle you sometimes that you know answer is quite obvious but you see a different answer is given so those situations are really bad for the typical model question papers in the market so it's always better you focus on uh, the actual last 10 question papers last five years that's enough because those are the actual questions uh, that was there in the CS Hamlet exam before those are the type of question that you are going to see in the upcoming exam so it's always better to go for the last year papers compared to the typical papers now from where you'll find the last five uh, years question paper it's quite easy you can find that easily from our website from my website as well as you can find that uh, you can you can get a book out of it like there's Upka's like there's Argupta's book of question and answers and even uh, some part of the Argupta book it, it explains a uh, few of the questions not all of the questions though the book suggests it's a complete explanation but actually few questions are only explained there but you'll get the answer key for every single question uh, Pathfinder publishes book for MCQ questions uh, again but no explanation only answers uh, only answer key and there is Arihant book only the single book Arihant explains uh, all the questions for last two years I guess four question papers or three question papers are there and that they have explained thoroughly the rest of them they haven't so that is uh, that is a, so that is another book that you can go with. so these are the part you can go with only by those book uh, which carries question and answers for the last five years if you get all these things that will be good to go so you don't need to buy every single book uh, out there if you want to buy any other compiled books you can go with that two book I mentioned as well as the MCQ books two one such MCQ book and two uh, the reference book for CSI net exam will be enough for you to get going look it's it's not about gaining all the books and notes like what happens at the end all those notes, all those books they're piling up in your in your table and you never read them it's very bad like gaining all those things and getting them from different sources makes you like satisfying yourself like I'm getting everything I'm preparing for net but actually you need to read and you need to practice for preparation so getting five different books and reading none is nothing compared to uh, getting one book and reading everything that will be much better so it's like buy one book read it complete it finish it start practicing questions then buy another one if you need don't rush in like it's not a, a job of getting all the books and telling other people that I have everything and I am preparing this is a very bad psychological problem uh, so try to get out of it and that will definitely help you so if you like this video please hit the like button share this video with your friends and subscribe to my channel to get more videos like that and like every year we are also conducting online as well as classroom coaching in Kolkata you can click the links that are provided in the annotations in both these cases in the bottom as well as in the card on the top and you'll be redirected to our page uh, where you can uh, go with the registration process so we are continuing the registration process thank you